Accidents happen, and bowel accidents can be frustrating and embarrassing. It helps if you can take charge of the situation. If you need assistance, you can make it easier for others to help by explaining the situation clearly and calmly. You may feel embarrassed, but don't let those feelings keep you from doing what's necessary to care for yourself. Over time, you'll find it easier to handle these embarrassing feelings. Remember that there's nothing wrong with you. This is just how your body works. Most people with spinal cord injury deal with the same problem. Mastery of your bowel program will give you confidence. If you do have a bowel accident, it's important to get cleaned up quickly. If you delay, you risk skin damage. If your injury is above T6, you might also experience autonomic dysreflexia if you block the flow of stool. It also helps to be prepared. If you think you might experience a bowel accident, take a change of clothes and some cleaning materials with you. If you have repeated problems with bowel accidents, you may want to revisit your bowel program using the problem-solving technique we just learned. Here are some tips to consider. Be sure your rectum is completely empty at the end of your program. Try increasing the frequency of your program. Some people with a flaccid bowel may need to empty their bowels more than once a day. Try using only half of a suppository. And monitor your diet for any foods that may overstimulate your bowel, such as spicy foods or greasy foods. For more help understanding how to prevent bowel accidents, click on the troubleshooting tab.